What is our second championship match of the evening? The WWE Tag Team Titles to be decided. And tonight's number one contenders, the challengers, Axiom and Nathan Frazier have come together in recent weeks on SmackDown and have taken the tag team division by storm. Two singles cruiserweight stars who have found a newfound allegiance and are looking to capitalize tonight on championship gold. And Axiom and Nathan Frazier can certainly be thanking each other for carrying the weight of the team. It all started in a matchup against the LWO. Rey Mysterio and Santos Escobar, where Axiom shined in the final moments, knocking down Rey Mysterio and picking up the victory just as several weeks ago on SmackDown. Well, that was really the kickoff to the momentum for these two young stars. It was on that night that Axiom and Nathan Frazier realized something was in the air, realized that they got a, a coherent pairing, if you will, and really took that momentum into a matchup with Imperium, Giovanni Vinci and Ludwig Kaiser a few weeks back on SmackDown, where they certainly proved their worth as the next number one contenders. Nathan Frazier has challenged for championship gold in the past, more specifically the cruiserweight title, never the tag team titles. A high profile situation with a newfound goal. These two men making to make, looking to make the most of it. As we mentioned, Axiom and Nathan Frazier just a number of weeks ago, 2v2 against Giovanni Vinci and Ludwig Kaiser of Imperium. Nathan Frazier, certainly the breakout star on that night. Taking the fight to the outside, Canadian Destroyer. Moments after that Topekin hero over the top rope, Frazier kept the foot on the gas pedal, much to the chagrin of Giovanni Vinci. Nathan Frazier taking out one half of Imperium and scoring a count out victory on that night. But as they say, a win is a win. And after two victories over two sustained tag teams on SmackDown, Really no denying that Axiom and Nathan Frazier are worthy challengers for the gold here tonight at Battleground. The 2023 King of the Ring winner has certainly made a lot of noise since last June, challenging for championship gold and winning championship gold on Friday Night SmackDown. One half of the WWE Tag Team Champions one half of the 2024 SmackDown Dusty Rhodes Tag Team Classic winners, the man from A-Town, the young, brash, egotistical, yet certainly talented, Austin Theory walking down the aisle with the lights on bright. You know, dare I say, Austin Theory has really become one of the faces of Friday Nights over the last year. Whether he's been at the top of the card or the bottom, Austin Theory, like it or not, always shines and certainly has been producing results since before WrestleMania in the Dusty Rhodes Tag Team Classic Tournament. 2024 has been very generous to a town down under. But will their reign at the top expire before our very eyes? Axiom and Nathan Frazier, the rocket has been strapped to their back. They've been riding a high, but is the fire about to be put out by Austin Theory and Grayson Waller? Austin Theory riding high off a of victory, as we saw moments ago over Rey Mysterio just 24 hours ago on SmackDown. A confidence boost that I'm sure is always welcome. But as for this man, the Aussie icon Grayson Waller may have celebrated Austin Theory's victory last night, but certainly wasn't celebrating his loss just a few weeks ago on Friday Night SmackDown. One half of the WWE Tag Team Champions, Grayson Waller, went toe to toe with one half of the number one contenders, Nathan Frazier, in an extraordinary battle. Just eight nights ago on Friday nights, Nathan Frazier doing what he does best, soaring through the skies and picking up a huge victory over one half of the WWE Tag Team Champions. Hard to say who's got the momentum on their side tonight. The champions are the champions, and the champion's always the favorite. But nobody can deny the momentum of Nathan Fraser and Axiom. A-Town down under got their work cut out for them tonight. The WWE Tag Team titles exclusive to Friday Night SmackDown are on the line here at the SmackDown exclusive Battleground event. The Golden One Center's been rocking all night long. Let's send things down to the ring for your official match introductions.
The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall and is for the WWE Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challengers at a combined weight of 336 pounds. The team of Axiom and Nathan Frazier. And their opponents at a combined weight of 426 pounds. The team of Austin Theory and Grayson Waller. A town down under looking confident as ever, as they always do. But are they handing over the WWE Tag Team titles for the last time in their championship reign that kicked off on Sunday night, March the 2nd? Austin Theory and Grayson Waller already with a successful reign under their belt. Defending the golds against Alpha Academy on the first SmackDown of the season. Axiom and Nathan Fraser, the next duo to step up. Will they be the kryptonite? That's what we look for right here, right now, as this tag team title match is underway. Axiom high out of the gate, and this is what Theory and Waller need to avoid tonight from the challengers, letting the challengers set the pace and soar through the skies as they prefer to do so. Axiom not wasting any time, no hesitation for one half of the challengers. Just trying to wear down Austin Theory and the man on the apron, Grayson Waller, with their high risk maneuvers. Can't blame Axiom and Frazier is what brought them to the dance, not just to number one contendership, but to the stage of Friday Night SmackDown. And now here on this huge stage tonight of Battleground in Sacramento, California, Frazier and Axiom looking to leave WWE Tag Team Champions. Nathan Frazier with his own shooting star press. Austin Theory on the receiving end of high risk and high reward from the challengers. This pace keeps up. Frazier and Axio may be winning the WWE Tag Team titles in short order tonight. Austin Theory looking like a man that doesn't know what hit him. And now being sent to the outside. History looking to repeat itself. Nathan Frazier with his eyes locked on the outskirts of the squared circle. Somewhere he is not afraid to be. Tope suicide through the ropes and sending Austin Theory like a bullet into the barricade. These two cruiserweight stars certainly know how to light an audience on fire. They have taken the division of the tag teams by storm. A victory over the LWO and Imperium brought them to the dance tonight, and it may lead them to tag team championship success before our very eyes. Austin Theory has gotten no offense in this matchup. It has been all Axiom and Nathan Frazier so far. This is what Austin Theory's got to do. Use his size and strength to his advantage and keep the cruiserweights grounded. Tag made to the Aussie icon, Grayson Waller. You got to believe Waller itching to get his hands on Frazier. After what some would say was an upset victory eight nights ago on SmackDown. As Frazier goes into the ropes and Grayson Waller making him pay for his troubles. The momentum of the tag team champion certainly going for a spin when Nathan Frazier delivered that Phoenix Flash in a victory eight nights ago on the blue brand. Grayson Waller making him pay with a shot right to the jaw and now trying to take out the legs. Pick apart the challengers, take away the high-flying offense. Notice how the pace has already begun to slow down a little bit in the champion's favor. This is what they got to do. Like him or not, it is smart strategy from A-Town down under. Tag back to Austin Theory. Big body theory, as he'd like to call it. Certainly something he better be leaning on against the fast and resilient challengers. You can call their victories over the LWO and Imperium flukes. You can call them upsets, but it's what got them here tonight. And it may be what leads them to the championships. Maybe not, if Austin Theory's got anything to say about it. Dropping Frazier right on his knee. Nathan Frazier, however, able to get the shoulder up. Austin Theory, great offense that time. Done a good job in grounding Nathan Frazier in the last few moments. We're going to see some tag team action here from the champions. Talk about what brung them to the dance. 
Three rounds of the SmackDown Dusty Rhodes Tag Team Classic. Rode that momentum, of course, into WrestleMania where they defeated the LWO to not only win the tournament, but kick off their reign as WWE Tag Team Champions. As we mentioned, already a successful defense of the gold on the first SmackDown of the season against Chad Gable and Otis of Alpha Academy. Will Nathan Frazier and Axiom be another stepping stone in their Tag Team Championship reign? Or will Grayson Waller and Austin Theory be falling to these challengers tonight? Grayson Waller dishing it right back to Frazier with a tope of his own. Grayson Waller showing Nathan Frazier not the only one who could take things to the sky if need be. Is that a little bit of desperation being shown out of one half of the tag team champions? Oh man! Blockbuster unprettier on the outside. That's enough to knock the lights out of Nathan Frazier any day of the week. Frazier's gonna try to shake the cobwebs off. Grayson Waller not allowing it. The blockbuster unprettier continuing to set a precedent in this tag team title matchup. Nathan Frazier survives, but certainly does not look like a man who is thriving at the current moment. Grayson Waller, stunner! Out of nowhere! And Axiom breaking things up. A last ditch effort for the challengers. If Axiom didn't break things up, you gotta believe this thing would be over. Nathan Frazier taking a lot of offense over the last few moments, but Grayson Waller misses wildly off the avalanche leg drop. And now a window of opportunity for the challengers to get back into the driver's seat. Oof. Maybe spoke too soon. Oh, and Frazier with a super kick. Both of these men down and out momentarily as Nathan Frazier gets a much needed tag to Axiom. It is now up to Axiom to try to get back into this matchup for the challengers. Look at the speed. Grayson Waller looking like he doesn't know what hit him. Axiom saying, where are you going? I can only win the titles between the ropes. Waller back into the ring. Met with a flying axe hammer. Nathan Frazier getting the hell beat out of him over the last few minutes makes a much needed tag to his tag team partner. And now all the pressure is on the shoulders of your mass superstar on center stage here at Battleground. Go for the German, nobody home. Grayson Waller goes behind as they jock for position and a neck breaker. Stop it, Axiom dead in his tracks. And great tag team matchup so far between the champions and the challengers. We were just last night on SmackDown, we saw another great tag team battle. Cruz del Toro and Joaquin Wilde picking up a huge victory over Angelo Dawkins and Montez Ford of the Street Profits. A show-stealing matchup 24 hours ago. Wait a minute. A town down. Within a blink of an eye, this match could be over. Not if Nathan Frazier's got anything to say about it. Frazier and Axiom finding out what it means to be a tag team tonight. Saving each other's backs back and forth in this matchup. Some close calls for the challengers. This thing would have been over with multiple times if it weren't for one saving the other. This is where partnerships are born. This is where brotherho brotherhoods are born in the midst of battle. Axiom and Nathan Frazier may be a new tag team, but they're working like an experienced one tonight. Axiom trying to shake off the cobwebs. He's got Austin Theory on his shoulders. Oof! Right down on the canvas. And now look at this. Stretching out Austin Theory. Going for a submission hold here. I don't know if he's got enough left in the tank to hold on. And Theory, the obvious stronger competitor. Well, great effort by one half of the challengers, but a lot might have been taken out off that A-Town down a few moments ago. Axiom trying to create some distance. Now into the corner he goes. Pace starting to slow down a little bit as the challengers are feeling the fatigue start to set in, but they got to rev up the engines here and do what they do best. Tilt to whirl, head scissors, Austin Theory down for his trouble. Poison run into Grayson Waller. Waller tagged in. 
and dropped on his dome. Oh, thrust kick. The same one that pinned Rey Mysterio number of weeks ago on the blue brand. And within mere inches of new tag team champions being crowned. Axiom with this matchup in the palm of his hands. Laid out Austin Theory with the head scissors. Theory made the tag. Immediately drops Waller with the poison Rana. Hits that thrust kick to the jaw. Unfortunately, the Aussie icon able to survive. Within inches of winning the WWE Tag Team titles. And now Nathan Frazier. Tag made to Axiom. See if Axiom can pick up where he left off a few moments ago. Realizing Grayson Waller may be near the end of this here. Axiom going off the top, but Waller moved out of the way at the last second. Crash and burn. They don't call it high risk, high reward for nothing. Now Grayson Waller once again slowing things down, taking the turnbuckle pad off. A-Town down under, never been, never been afraid, excuse me, to get their hands dirty. Just like that, the Golden One Center has been taken out of this matchup by hands of A-Town Down Under. The champions not looking to allow the challengers to rally. And Axiom going for a ride. Certainly not the kind of soaring through the sky he would like to do. That was the power of Theory and Waller that time. And item in Austin Theory with a cheap shot on Nathan Frazier. Trying to divide and conquer. Frazier goes down. Axiom trying to drag himself back into the ring. And wait a minute here. Fury allowed Axiom to get some R and R. Suplex to the outside. A great maneuver. Desperate times call for desperate measures. Strength being shown from within, from one half of the challengers. As Axiom muscles up Fury, now gets him back inside the squared circle. Axiom's got to capitalize. You got to believe that took a lot out of one half of the champions that time. Into the corner. Tagged back to Nathan Frazier, who's got to be ticked off after that cheap shot a few moments ago. Goes behind Austin Theory. Trying to find his way out of enemy territory. Nathan Frazier trying to keep his foot on the gas pedal. The challengers have an opportunity and not looking to see it fall through their hands. Nice swing blade, Nathan Frazier going up top. Swan time bomb! Into the cover, Grayson Waller breaking things up. How close have we been to a conclusion in this tag team title match? And Frazier, all's fair in love and war, knocking Grayson Waller off the apron. Now Frazier with Austin Theory in his grasp. Bringing him to enemy territory. The Aussie icon laid out at ringside, however. Look at this! Springboard! Frankenstein! New champions! Not just yet! Austin Theory with the shoulder up. These two teams leaving it all in the squared circle tonight. Nathan Frazier, the Swanton Bomb, the Springboard Frankensteiner, neither of it enough. Frazier into the ropes and Austin Theory knocking him down to size. Austin Theory just trying to find a way back into this matchup. Tag made to Grayson Waller. The Aussie icon who was knocked off the apron a few moments ago. Blockbuster on Prettier for the second time of the match. This time between the confines of the ropes. A town down under. Retain the tag team titles. Here are your winners. And still, WWE Tag Team Champions. The team of Austin Theory and Grayson. What a tag team matchup tonight in Sacramento. Axiom and Nathan Frazier leaving it all on the line. A great showing from that new tag team. 
But unfortunately for those cruiserweights, they fall short in their efforts as the WWE Tag Team Championships remain with Grayson Waller and Austin Theory. Last year, 16 of WWE's best cruiserweights clashed in an eight-week tournament to decide who stood above the rest at 205 pounds and under. This year, we do it all over again. Sunday afternoons at 12 p.m. Eastern Time, kicking off on September the 29th, 16 men representing SmackDown, NXT, and TNA Wrestling will participate in the 2024 edition of the Cruiserweight Classic. With the field more wide open than ever before, who will scratch and claw their way to greatness and be crowned the winner of the historic Cruiserweight Classic?